Welcome to Double Tap TV on YouTube. Thank you guys so much for being here. If you're not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button. In this clip from our second episode of season number five, we dive into keyboards and Steven doesn't help, can't help himself, but get interrupty. The latest tech. I'm Alexa. I can answer your questions. Interviews. And we are evolving and we are seeing an amazing opportunity that's happening. Accessibility. Accessibility is, is one of our core values. It's even a part of our mission statement. This is Double Tap TV. Welcome to another edition of Double Tap TV. Thank you guys for being with us each and every single week. An exciting show lined up for you this week. I am Marco Flalo and Stephen Scott, as Mark, always, Mark, with us this Mark, week. Talking Mark, all about, yeah, okay, Mark, yeah, yeah. Look, I, yes. I know you love to do these big introductions to the show, and you know it's like really professional and all that, and you know say the name of the show and social media, all that stuff. Forget all that sad. stuff because I want to talk about something so cool. All right. Okay. I want to talk and about keyboards. That? I want to talk about keyboards. I'm holding oh. a keyboard. I love <laughs> keyboards. Mm, I'm stroking my keyboard. Oh I my love God. keyboards. <laughs> can we talk about keyboards? We can, we can talk about keyboards. Can I tell you a story first? Because um, it, and it's related okay, somewhat to on. keyboards. Um, earlier this summer, I was invited on a live stream by Kensington. Now, Kensington makes, I mean, if you think the name Kensington, I think what comes to mind is those little computer locks for laptops. But they also make accessories across the board. They make um, good iOS accessories, great made for surface accessories, uh, mice and keyboards and all, all, all that fun stuff that we're talking about, right? Uh, but the big thing about this conversation that I had on, on their live stream was it was all about ergonomics and what the industry is talking about when it comes to ergonomics. And of course, what came up, and I'm going to grab over here off camera here for a second. They sent me this after the conversation. This is a ergonomic keyboard from Kensington. It's one of these natural keyboards that are split down the middle so that your wrists are resting naturally on the keyboard as opposed to being twisted. So guess what? I'm kind of prepared for this conversation. Okay, fine. And you can be prepared. Although that is the worst keyboard ever made. And I promise you, you will never use it a day what? in your life. I'm sorry. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait, Kensington is the worst keyboard? No, no, the, the no, that style, style of keyboard. keyboard. They all make okay, it, Logitech you. make it, Microsoft. Don't piss off the people. Okay, fine. <laughs> Kensington are brilliant. I'm saying nothing bad against Kensington. But that style of keyboard, I, I don't think that, I mean, I know some friends of mine use it and they love that split design. It's kind of like, it, it feels like it's got a big bulge in it underneath. It's like, like a battery exploded underneath and now it's sticking up. Okay, well, there's a purpose, Stephen. There's a purpose, and that purpose is, is to literally keep your hands in a natural position. Right now, I'm showing you the side of my hand. When is you're on a regular keyboard, think about it. Your hands are twisted. They're not naturally straight, okay? There's a curvature mm -hmm. that's going on here. So to make it more ergonomically friendly and more healthy and better for you as a human being, okay? You might not, might not like it, but people, you know, kind of want to not get carpal tunnel syndrome, is to keep your hand in a more natural rested position. That means your palms are a little bit more elevated. Your, the, the actual curvature of your, your wrist and the bend is not as prevalent. So there's a reason behind these. And by the way, this is the reason that I actually know how to type properly because prior to ergonomic keyboards like this, natural keyboards, I remember it was a Microsoft keyboard. I was typing with one finger on each hand. Now, I was typing <laughs> faster than I think anybody, uh, any of my friends who were touch typing and everything. I was super fast with my two fingers, but this keyboard taught me how to actually type properly, and I have to credit it for that. Not Kensington's in particular, but I think it was the Microsoft Natural Keyboard at the time. Well, I'm glad you've learned to touch type. That is very important. I learned on a typewriter, Mark, so there was no ergonomics in those days. It was pretty much just you know, go for it or else you'll learn nothing. But I do want to talk about keyboards today, not the ergonomic ones, but you're absolutely right. They are fantastic. And if you can use them and you like them, it wasn't for me, but if you like them, enjoy. I bet you'll never use it any day in your life. But today we're going to talk about, well, I've decided I'm hijacking the show here, Mark. Sorry, Mark. Uh, but I have got so many keyboards here. I mentioned my Logitech I've got here. I've got my Apple Magic keyboard with Touch ID. That's really nice. Um, I've got my Which, trusty... by the way, only works with the newer generation computers. Yeah, and iPads, iPad Pros and okay. certain generations. Okay, fine. Uh, but I also have this, my traditional cabled wired keyboard. Remember these? This has got a USB connection on it. I've got one of these. It's HP, and I only keep it because this is the one I use when all these fancy ones fail. 
So I'm going to talk to you about these keyboards and why I have them and some other keyboards. The, the question I think we're going to be trying to answer today is what is the best keyboard for 2022? Okay. And can we even answer that question? That's a that's a very, very good uh, a good target to aim for, and let's see if we can do that. You are watching Double Tap TV with Stephen Scott and Mark Aflalo. Let's take a quick break and dive into that keyboard porn of, uh, <laughs> of Stephen's when we come back. Stick around. You're watching Double Tap TV. Get involved. Follow us at Double Tap On Air or email us feedback at doubletaponair.com. Double Tap TV will be right back. Thanks for watching this Double Tap video. If you like it, please hit that subscribe button and like it. And of course, that notification bell will let you know when we've got a new video like this to share. Thanks for watching.